You're gonna to wanna to hit save on this video because I'm gonna show you how to make your very own ChatGPT trading bot. And yes, I'm gonna address the compilation errors and other issues that ChatGPT has been producing in lines of code. Before we get into this, let me just add a quick disclaimer. Be sure you understand the risks involved when you get into trading and always make sure you follow the guidelines of TikTok and other platforms. I'm only showing you this as an example and it's not actual investment advice. Now, with that out of the way, let's get into the main issue. So if I ask ChatGPT to design me a strategy from scratch using the MACD indicator as an example, but if I take this and paste it directly into my PineScript editor, it immediately gives me a compilation error. Now the workaround for this is quite creative, but mind blowing. So what we're gonna do is work off the public database to train ChatGPT to code us a strategy from already pre-existing strategies that are out there. And it's gonna make improvements on those. To do that, we head over to Trading View and hit Indicators and Strategies. Scroll onto the Technicals tab and hit Strategy. As an example, I'm just gonna use an already pre-existing MACD strategy in the public database. As you can see, this already gives me the performance summary of how this performed historically. Things like comparing max drawdown, buy and hold return, sharp ratio and Sortino ratio, as well as profit factor are extremely important concepts that I'll get into later. For now, all you need to worry about is opening the source code. So we're gonna hit these brackets right here. We're gonna hit Copy on the strategy, head back to ChatGPT, paste it in, and ask ChatGPT just to quickly explain the strategy. What's useful here is we're gonna understand the logic for how the strategy works in natural language. So what this MACD strategy does is it uses cross over or cross under. So if there's a cross over, it's gonna long. If there's a cross under, it'll short. And if we wanted, we could go back to the library and trading view, paste in another script and ask it to combine these for us. So we're gonna take the MACD strategy and combine it with another one. And this is just an example, but I'm gonna use support and resistance. So I'm gonna head back to TradingView's public database, hit on indicators and strategies, and I'm just gonna pick the first one. This is just random. Now that it's added to my chart, I'm gonna open the source code. We're gonna check the PineScript version. This one's in V4, we gotta update it to V5. It's really simple to do that. Click the three dots, hit make a script copy, and now we can edit this. So just hit the three dots again, select convert to V5. There we go, now we can copy all of this, head back to our ChatGPT session, and ask it to combine the MACD strategy with this one. This modified strategy is generating buy and sell signals based on the previous strategy. So what we're gonna do is modify them further. Now a basic concept that I'm gonna use as an example is gonna be whether price break above a support and resistance line in confluence with the MACD indicator. Now if you're looking for inspiration for ideas, you can just ask ChatGPT to generate you a list of ideas for potential trading rules. And then you can proceed from there to incorporate those rules into your strategy. And because it's building off of a pre-existing template that you've supplied it, it's already trained to not produce trading view errors. I'm not done yet, but if you found this valuable be sure to hit the like button save the video for later or head over to my youtube channel where i'm going to be doing a more in-depth video of how to do this and i'll be doing more advanced examples tons of people have been joining my discord as well be sure to join there and you can ask the community as many questions as you like and bounce ideas off of each other i'm going to be creating a special chat just for chat gpt discussion so with this example if the closing price breaks above the resistance line and the macd is increasing it will enter a position. Beautiful. Let's copy this and check out how it functions. There, it's compiled and it's completely done. There's no errors in this code. So we're gonna hit add to chart. This is our breakout and MACD strategy. As you can see, it shorted when it broke down below this support line. And when it broke on top of this line with this huge candle, it longed again. Now from here, it's all about developing further rules and adjusting the settings. To adjust the settings, simply open up the cog wheel here in our strategy and you can modify all of these variables. So if I change the support and resistance lines, we're gonna get different breakout levels. For example, this is where our long breakout moved to. And since this line is our new support level, when we broke below it, it shorted after that candle. It also caught this breakout extremely well. Now again, this needs a lot of work and it is just an example. I'm gonna post it also in my Discord chat so you can copy and paste it into your PineScript browser. Again, this is not a robustly trained strategy. Do not trade with this with real money. Hopefully this can be developed further and people can post updates and variations from this strategy in the Discord. That's all for now and subscribe if you wanna see more videos just like this one.